Come on, let's give our God some praise. Come on, come on, come on. He's worthy, he's worthy, he's worthy. He's worthy, he's worthy, he's worthy to be praised. What a mighty, 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 mighty God that we serve. To God be all of the honor and the glory. Let our God be glorified to all of the those who have given tributes as we honored black history. Let's give them a hand. Job well done. Job par excellent. Come on, we can do better than that for all of our children all month, all month. They've been honoring living legends. And for that, we are truly, truly, truly thankful. And we are truly grateful. I would be remiss if I did not thank you, <laughs> Elijah. I call him E Boogie. Um, thank you for mentioning what you just said because I would be remiss if I did not honor the life and the legacy. Come on, St. Luke, of a great sage. Let us stand. Honor. Black History Month. Dolphin Smith. Reverend Walter L. Harding, come on, come on. We can do way better than 84 years. The St. Luke Baptist Church, Dolphin Smith, Reverend Walter L. Harding, and the great, the great Reverend Dr. J.G. McCann. We would not be here had it not been for those spiritual trailblazers. Come on, come on, give it up for them. They're in glory. I'm sorry, you can remain standing. You can remain standing. go to the word of God found in Psalm 84 I'm going to go to Psalm 84 and 12 Let's conclude this fruition series Psalm 84 and 12 when you found Psalm 84 and 12 please signify by saying amen and the word of God one verse and the word of God reads as thus O Lord of hosts blessed is the man whose trust in you this is the word of the Lord I'm going to preach under the direction of the Holy Ghost I'm ready to trust God. I'm ready to trust God. Somebody say, I'm ready to trust God. Let us pray. Father in heaven, thank you. My God, my God, my God, my God. We thank you for your presence in this place. Thank you, Master. God, we thank you for bringing us over. You've been real, real good to this church and to us as a people. God, we say thank you. As we have our service, as we are 
in. We are in what your shepherd prayed for and what he saw. God, we say thank you. Holy Spirit, speak to us. I lay down, Master, you stand up. Get all of the glory now, all of it. Thank you. We come this far by faith. You've been real good to us. For those watching live stream, those of us, Master, we have listening ears and eyes to see. We're listening to what the Spirit will say to the church. We are thankful. I'm thankful and grateful, Master. To carry on in this branch of Zion. I'm thankful, I'm grateful to be chosen for such a time as this. We love you and we adore you. In the name that is above every name. In all reality, the only name that matters, and that is Jesus the Christ. We love you and we adore you, my God. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. How many of you know on this Lord's day, we have to just trust God? Do I have a witness? Do I have a witness? Do I have a witness? Do I have anybody who's with me who know we have to, we must trust God? Do I have anybody who trusts the Lord? Scripture tells us, Psalm tell us in Psalm 16 and 1, Psalm 16 and 1, the Psalm says, Preserve me, O God, for in you I put my trust. Preserve me, O God, for in you I put my trust. Scripture tells us also in 2 Corinthians 3 and 4, 2 Corinthians 3 and 4, Scripture tells us, and we have such trust through Christ towards God. And we have such trust through Christ towards God. How many of you know we got to keep trusting God no matter what? Somebody say no matter what. Bible teaches us in Psalm 84, written by the sons of Korah, the history now, history of these sons of Korah. I want you to write it down in 1 Chronicles 9 and 19, the history of these sons of Korah. 1 Chronicles 9 and 19, the history of these sons of Korah, these gatekeepers of the tabernacle. Scripture tells us in 1 Chronicles 9 and 19, the latter part of these sons of Korah that we see in Psalm 84, scripture says their fathers had been keepers of the entrance to the camp of the Lord. They had been keepers to the entrance to the camp of the Lord. This uh, uh, Psalm 84 written by the sons of uh, Korah. These sons of Korah penned uh, Psalm 84 under the auspices of the spirit of uh, God. And when we look at Psalm 84, here's what we find, beloved. How many of you know, watch this, God uh, has us uh, here. God has us uh, here. Somebody say, God has uh, us here. Uh, here, when we look at Psalm 84, beloved, the psalmist in 84 talks about the power of prayer. Lord of hosts, hear my prayer. How many of you know uh, it is prayer that has you here? How many of you know it is prayer that has uh, you here for such a time uh, as this? God has us uh, here. How many of you know uh, you are here by the grace of God, by the mercy of God, uh, and because of the power of uh, prayer? How many of you know prayer kept you before? Prayers was keeping you now. 
And how many of you know prayer has you here? My God, my God, my God. God has us here. Somebody say God has us here. Lord, have mercy. How many of you are grateful for your here? Oh, my God. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Did somebody catch that? I said, how many of you are grateful for your here? You, 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 you're not where you used to be. Man, 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 man. But anybody grateful, no, ma no matter where you are, but God got you here. My God, my God. And how many of you know, because God got me here, can nothing or nobody do nothing about it? Because God is the one who has us. Ma, 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 ma. God, God uh, has us uh, here. Oh, God. Watch. We were here. Then went to the school. Man, come on, St. Luke. You got to catch this. And then from the school went to the park. Man, do anybody see where I'm going? And then God. Oh, man, man. He, he, he brought us back. Come on, St. Luke. Come on. Come on. You got anybody grateful? God has us here. Psalmist teach us, watch this. God has us here. And then the psalmist teaches us God is our help. So, how, somebody say God is our help. God has us here and then God is our help. No good thing. Oh, man. Will he withhold from those uh, Oh, my God, my God. When you walk up rightly, God will send you help. Do I have any believers here uh, who are watching live, live stream who says, uh, Dr. Hilliard, I will lift up my eyes. Nah, I feel this anointing on this one. Uh, I will lift up my eyes to the hills from whence cometh my help. My help. Oh, my God, my God. How many of you know my help comes from the Lord? Oh, God has us here. God is our oh, help. He's our help. Oh, he's, he not only has us here, but he's our help in a time, man, 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 of trouble. <laughs> Have you ever been in trouble and needed help? My, 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 my. God, God is our help. He's our help, beloved. I want to share with you on this Lord's Day that, watch this, God works miracles when you trust him. Put in that live chat for me. God works miracles when you trust him. Somebody say, God works miracles when you trust him. One more again. God works miracles when you trust him. How many of you know that to be true, that that's not just a text, but that's operative in your life, that God uh, has worked some miracles because you put your trust in him. Uh, when you watch this, beloved, when you trust him, trust means to be confident. It means to be confident. It means you're sure. How many of you know I'm confident in God? I'm sure in God. When you trust him, it means you're confident. It means uh, that you're sure. Uh, uh, how many of you, you know you're confident because you're sure in Christ? How many of you know you're confident in Christ? You're, you're sure in Christ. Trust not only means confident. Somebody say confident. Somebody say sure. But trust means to be secure. Somebody say secure. Uh, somebody say secure. And how many of you are grateful that because your trust is in Jesus, he keeps you secure? How many of you know you're secure that that God has you in the palm of his hand because uh, you trusted him before? You are trusting him now because uh, your trust is not in a political system, is not in no money, is not in a friend, is not in a foe, is not in things, is not in people. How many of you know your trust got to be in God? It's got to be in Jesus Christ. And when uh, you put your trust in him as your personal 
personal Lord and Savior, he will take you to higher heights and uh, deeper depths. I said, when you put your trust in Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior, he will take you to higher heights and deeper depths. One more again, when you put your trust in uh, Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior, he will take you to higher heights and uh, deeper depths. I know I'm here right now because I put my trust in Jesus Christ. Uh, and ever since I put my trust in Jesus, my life has never, ever 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 been uh, the same am i alone uh, whoever since you put your trust and your confidence in christ uh, he has been keeping you been watching over and you've been feeding you been uh, covering you been uh, anointing you been uh, blocking people and bringing you in been uh, showing you favor been uh, giving you good thing after a good thing and giving you health and giving you wealth and giving you strength and giving you power and giving you anointing and giving you favor and giving you strength and uh, giving you watch this one breath uh, in your body to be alive because you put your trust in I put I put I put my trust in Jesus how many of you know my trust is in Christ and when you put your trust in Jesus, I want you to know, beloved, your salvation is secured. Anybody grateful that uh, uh, my salvation is secured, is sealed until the day of redemption? How many of you are grateful ever since you put your trust in Jesus? Your salvation is secured when you trust him. Beloved, it means uh, also to be bold. Somebody say be bold. Be, somebody say be bold. When you trust God, he gives you a boldness. Do, do, he gives you a boldness. He, he, he lets you be so secure in him that you don't fear man. You don't fear people. You don't fear things. And for some of you, 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 you got... You got to, I'm not worried about nothing disposition because uh, you're bold and you're sure in Christ and you know that he did it before, he's doing it now. And uh, I got such a track record with him that uh, I, I, all I got to do is think about what he did yesterday. My, 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 my. If, and, and don't let me really go back in uh, memory lane and I start reflecting and thinking about how he brought me over for every mountain you brought me over for every trial you seen me through the Lord is my anchor he's my trust and because of that I can be bold and I need to warn you now when you're bold the enemy don't like it he don't no 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 he he wants you to be nervous purpose he wants you to be shook he wants you to be scared he wants you to walk around but uh where the believers who says, Reverend, because uh, my trust is in Jesus, uh, I can walk around bold saying, uh, the God I serve, uh, he brought me before and uh, I know he going to bring me through uh, this time so I could be bold and, 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 and don't get mad if you walk around scared and I'm not. No, 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 no. That, 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 yo, 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 fear. Thank you, Holy Ghost, has nothing to do with my boldness. As a matter of fact, I want you to be bold in Christ because your trust is in Jesus. When you're ready to trust God, beloved, here's what happens. God will work on your behalf. Somebody say, God will work on my behalf. How many of you know God is working on your behalf right now? I said, how many of you know God is working on your behalf? I said, he's working on your behalf. Here it is. Scripture says, O Lord of hosts. Somebody say host. I've told you before, beloved, that host also means worship. Host means not only worship and hardship, 
But watch this, beloved. Host, this word, host, it means waiting upon. It means waiting upon. Somebody say, waiting upon. And uh, do I have a believer logging on? Do I have a believer who says, uh, I'm uh, waiting on God? And uh, when I wait on God, my, he never ceases to amaze me. Oh, my God. He never ceases to amaze how uh, he put checks in your hand you wasn't looking for how he pays rent and how he pays mortgages and how uh, he got a way of touching Caesar to overlook others and anoint you and says uh, no not them this is the one uh, that I want you to because uh, they was waiting on the system but my child is waiting on me and they have uh, waited long enough so guess what uh, favor them right now uh, put power in them right now uh, strengthen them right now because they've been waiting on me I'm, I'm, I'm. how 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 many of you know that you thank God for people but you're not waiting on them wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute wait 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 now you know a whole lot of folk get upset when they think that uh, you waiting on them, but then uh, you got to bust a bubble and say, no, 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 no. Uh, I love you, but I'm not waiting on you. I ain't got no help. I ain't got no help. You say, I'm waiting on God. I'm waiting on the Lord of hosts. And when I wait on the Lord of hosts, he shows up for me. Do I got a believer? Has he ever showed up for you? Has he ever dried your tears in the middle of the night? Ha has he ever made ways for you out of no way? How many of you know right now God is working on your behalf? I feel God's power. I feel God's power. Listen to me. Listen to the Holy Ghost. Watch this. On this 28th day, God right now, right now is working on your behalf. Somebody say right now, while we sit in worship. How many of you know he's a right now God? Ah, God, I feel this. I said, how many of you know he's a right now God? Ah, uh, uh, he's working on your behalf. He's the Lord of uh, hosts. Somebody say hosts. Watch this. Job waited on him. Oh, my God. In all the days of my appointed time. Ah, uh, Job says, I'm going to wait until, oh, my, 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 until my change. Oh, my God. How am I the only one on this Lord's Day feel change all in the atmosphere? Anybody grateful God is changing you? Come on, St. Luke. How many of you know he's changing you? He's changing how you talk, changing how you walk, changing how you view people. Changing how you view yourself. Changing those who you thought was for you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. How, 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 how many of you know God, when, when he's working on your behalf, he'll, and he'll also show you, watch this, uh, who you need to get away from. Because, uh, oh my God, my God, my God, my God. Because he's working on your behalf. Job said, I'm wait till my change come. Prophet Isaiah says, uh, those who wait on the Lord, they shall mount up. Somebody say mount up. <laughs> Somebody say mount up. Tell your haters I'm mounting up. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, tell all those who thought you wouldn't make it, I'm mounting up. You didn't think I was going to make it. Oh, oh, you didn't think St. Luke was going to make it, make it, but. But we, my, oh, wait, 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 where my mountain up Christians at? Where, where the believers who say I'm mounting up, I'm getting out of this rut, I'm going to shake this thing off, and I'm going to mount up because God is uh, working on my behalf. He's, he's working, he's working on, oh God, your behalf. He's working right now. Somebody say he's working right now. 
I believe he's working in the earth realm. And if he's working in the earth realm, that means he's working in the spirit realm. How many of you know when you pray, God will move on your behalf? I said, when you pray, God will move uh, on uh, your behalf. How many of you thankful that you've been in your secret place? Come on, St. Luke. I said, you've been in your secret place. And uh, when you've been in your secret place, God will work on your Oh, my God, my God, Lord of uh, hosts. Somebody say hosts. And you do need to know that uh, when, uh, because he's the Lord of hosts, my God, that means uh, more than one. I'm just, I'm just, somebody say more than one. See, God is so powerful. Thank you, Holy Ghost, that, that, that he, he has angels encamped. Ay, 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 ay. God, I feel his anointing. He, he has angels. My, my, my. How many of you are grateful that God has angels uh, working on your behalf? And uh, sometimes God uh, will send you more than one. He, he, he's, he's the Lord of hosts. Oh, my God. How many of you are grateful that he's so powerful and because he's working on my behalf? Uh, he'll send an angel to protect me he'll send an angel to heal me he'll send an angel to watch over my child he'll send oh uh, come on how many of you know he's the lord of a uh, host god uh, will work on your behalf so so what are you what what, what are you saying dr hilliard that when i show up know that i'm not alone i'm just i'm just i'm I'm just, I'm just saying, ah, God, I feel his anointed. How many of you know when you walk up on the job, when you walk in the supermarket, when you go to check your mail, when you go to your car, my God, folk, folk got to know you're not alone. You, 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 you got to know I got angels. My, 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 ah, he's working on my behalf. He's the Lord of Host, when you're ready to trust God, he'll work on your behalf. Somebody say, God is working on my behalf. Here it is, beloved. Secondly, and uh, finally, when God is, uh, when you're ready to trust God, watch this. God is uh, the source of your contentment. Uh, thank you, Holy Ghost. Somebody say, God is the source of my contentment no 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 how many of you know god is the source of your contentment oh no 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 saint luke ha do i got somebody who knows god is my source my my wait let me go to the psalm oh lord of hosts blessed is the man who trusts in you Bless it. Somebody say bless it. Let me let, let, let me let me let me poll online. Let me ask anybody. How many of you know where, where, where the blessed folk at? Let me just check. I'm, I'm uh, where, where, how many of you have been blessed by the best? <laughs> and and how many of you know, truth be told, Reverend, I'm a blessed mess. You ain't going to keep it a stack with me. You, how, how many of you know I'm a mess, but I'm blessed? I'm just saying. I know. And, and how many of you, you keep it a stack with me and you say, I, at least I know I'm a mess. I, I admit to that. I, I'm not walking around like I'm holier than thou than anybody. I know my flaws. I know my deficiencies, but I'm still blessed is what I'm saying. I'm, I'm, <laughs> what, what, what? Oh, oh, I'm not alone alone. I got some people then who's like me, a blessed mess. And, and how many of you are grateful that God, uh, ah, my, 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 he, he know how to, to, when you make a mess, he still turns around and call you blessed. Am I the only one who made a mess before? But you know, watch this, God is the source of your contentment. Bless it. Somebody say bless it. Watch this. This word blessed beloved. It 
means to be called blessed. God Almighty. God Almighty. Somebody say to be called blessed. This word blessed, it means to be called blessed. It refers to the people of God. How many of you know that when and if God calls you blessed? Do I got any believers who says God calls me blessed? Then that means I'm blessed. No, 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 no. Because there are folk who look at your life and if you mess up or they think you do something wrong, that you're not blessed. Somebody say, you got it twisted. God done forgave me. He done woke me up this morning. I repented. I, I, I'm godly sorrowful and not just rhetoric, but he forgave me. How many of you are grateful he's a forgiving God and not of a second chance or third or fourth or fifth or sixth or seven or eight. Oh, oh, when I get how many of you know I can keep counting. I lost count already. How many times I messed up, but he still calls me blessed. The devil in hell can't do nothing about it. God calls me blessed. And if he calls uh, me blessed, I'm going to walk like it. I'm going to talk like it. I'm going to act like it. I'm going to live like it. I'm going to quote scripture like it. When I walk, I'm going to walk in my anointing. I'm going to walk in my power. I'm going to walk in the anointing that God gave me. Uh, where the blessed folk at uh, who tired of struggling, who tired of just barely making it, but because uh, you God's anointed uh, and he calls uh, you blessed, you can uh, speak to the mountain, uh, you can uh, speak to the rock, uh, you can at times you may have to speak to your, oh my God, anybody ever had to speak to yourself? I said anybody ever had to speak to yourself? Have you ever got to a point in your life where you had to say, get yourself up? Uh, 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 enough all. Oh, oh, my God. Am I, am I the only one uh, who ever had to speak to your blessedness and say, I'm better than this? Ay, yeah, yeah. God got more for me. Do, do, do I got anybody who says, uh, because I'm blessed, I'm going to get everything. No, I'm sorry. My bad. Everything that God got for me. Do I got a believer who says, uh, I'm going after everything that God got for my life. Because I am uh, blessed. It means to be called uh, blessed. How many of you know, beloved? How many of you know, beloved, that God is the source of your contentment? How many of you know God is the source? How many of you know when you're blessed, that means you're happy. You're genuinely happy. You got joy. Do I got anybody who got Jesus joy? Jesus, uh, you are the center. Oh, my God. How many of you know when you got joy, you walk around happy. You walk around smiling. You really got folk who wondering why in the middle of a pandemic, Pandemic, uh, you still showing all your pearly whites. Uh, you still getting up smiling, getting yourself dressed, uh, honey, because God is the source uh, of my contentment. And because he's the source uh, of my contentment, uh, I'm going to smile every single day. Uh, I'm going to get up in the morning and say, good morning, Jesus. Uh, I may not have what I want yet, but uh, it is on the way. Uh, and because God uh, is the source of my contentment uh, I'm walking like it I mean uh, I'm gonna be acting real bad and bougie because my God uh, got greatness for me uh, who in here walking towards uh, your greatness who in here going after everything uh, that God got for your uh, life when you trust him uh, that means I am going uh, after it 
after. How many of you saying, Reverend, uh, I'm going after all that God got for my life. He, 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 he's the ha God. He's the, somebody say he's the source because I trust him. How many of you know he's going to come through? For somebody, watch him come through this week. I ain't got no help. I ain't got no help. I said, watch him come through this week. I said, watch him come through this week. Watch him come through. Who is the Holy Ghost talking to? I said, watch my God come uh, through uh, this week. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and uh, forever. When, I don't know about you, but when I think of the goodness of Jesus, I said, when I think of the goodness of Jesus, and all he's done for me, I don't know, my soul. Come on, St. Luke, 84 years, uh, your soul ought to be crying. <laughs> you woke up in favor. <laughs> My, my, my. I said you woke up in favor. You woke up in blessings. Blessed in the city. Blessed in the field. Uh, blessed when you go out. Uh, blessed when you come in. Uh, because I'm ready to trust my God. Uh, for somebody, you got to take your trust up another level. I said for somebody, you got to take your trust up another level. Somebody say take it up a level. Come on, put that in the live. Somebody say, take it up a level. Take it up another. Somebody say, take it up another level. Wait a minute. 84 years? Come on, St. Luke. 84 years in the village of Harlem during a pandemic. I said, during a pandemic, when people are out of their mind, here we are, bless. Somebody say, I'm blessed. God Almighty, somebody say, I'm blessed. Woke up, I'm blessed. Got my health, I'm blessed. I got the, the, all of my money ain't get here yet, but it's on the way. God gonna set St. Luke up in such a way we ain't got to borrow from nobody. You ain't got to cry to nobody because when you trust God, when you trust him, he'll show up. How many know he'll show up? Ay, ay, ay. How many, how many of you, how many of you saying he, 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 he showed up already? I ain't got no help. I ain't got no help. I said he showed up already. How he showed up already, Reverend? Well, you alive. I said you alive. When you're ready to trust God. My, my, my. Somebody say, I'm ready to trust God. How many of you trust him? I said, how many of you really trust him? Your, your, your faith. Ah, God, it's in Jesus. You don't make it this many years without trusting in Jesus. We, we, watch this. We stand on the shoulders of some spiritual giants who trusted God because they knew if he did it before. Somebody said if he did it before, he can. How many of you know, how many of you know, your again is coming this week? Man. I'm ready. I'm ready. Somebody say, my again is coming this week. I don't know why the Holy Ghost pressing that on me. I don't know what you need this week, but watch God. Hey, glory. Watch God. Watch God. Watch God show up for you. How many of you know he'll take care of it? If it's his will, it's his bill. He got it. Somebody say, my God got it. 
Stand to your feet. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to trust God. God says, trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. God says, trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me with your faith. Trust me with your family. Trust me with your finances. Trust me for your future. Trust me. Father, I pray for those who need to trust you. God, I pray, I pray, Master, for those who need a faith booster. God, somebody, somebody, the pandemic lowered their trust in you. Oh, God. But today, God, I pray that you would touch their heart for somebody watching, for somebody struggling in their faith. Woo, God, 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 God. God, you, you use this moment as a spiritual reset. Woo, God, give them another lease on life. God, I pray for someone's parent who's worried about their child. I pray in the name of Jesus that they put their trust in you. That they'll drop the worry, drop the fear, drop the anxiety, drop the concern, drop the overwhelmness. They're overwhelmed, but that they will put their trust in you renew someone's trust Jesus oh God renew someone's trust in you God we thank you because we trust you I mean we really trust you because if you did it for us we believe you can do it for our children we know you can help us oh God in moments of weakness moments of weakness Help us when those moments come, Master. Build us up. Build us up. We say thank you that our, that our faith, our trust is renewed like the eagles. My God. God, we're ready to mount up now. We love you. We thank you. We're going to trust you. We know you're going to do it. We know you're going to do it. And we give you glory. We give you honor. And we give you strength. Because you are our strength. You are our help. In a time of trouble. We trust you Jesus. Oh God we trust you. Have your way. In Jesus name. My God. If there's somebody watching. If there's somebody watching live stream who does not know Christ, who does not know Christ, this moment right here. And you may say, well, I'm in another state. I'm in another borough. I'm not physically there. God is omnipotent. He's omniscient. He's omnipresent. He's everywhere. Oh, man, man, man. I, I, I want to encourage you to put your trust in Jesus. Let me tell you, when you put your trust in Jesus, he won't fail you. If that's you, man of God, woman of God, child of God, I want you to repeat after me. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I admit I'm weak. I need help. I need strength. I admit you to be my savior. I believe 
that you raised your son, Jesus the Christ, from the dead. And I receive Jesus Christ as my personal Lord and Savior. Thank you for hearing my cry. I love you. In Jesus' name, amen. Come on, give God glory. Give him glory. Give him glory, beloved. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. You put your trust in Jesus. You put your trust in Jesus. He'll bring you through. He'll bring you through. He'll bring you through. Right there. That's, that's the song. Please sing that song. Please sing that song. Yes. Come on, lift your hands. We're going to trust him. Come on and worship. Let's take your mind off your problems. Take your mind off it. Just say, Lord, I trust you. Trust you with my family. Trust you with the job. Trust you during a pandemic. Come on. Come on, lift your hands in worship, in your bathroom, in your kitchen, in your car, wherever you are. Just say, Lord, I trust you. God is fighting for you. He's working it out. He's working it out. Just trust him. Just trust him. Let us look to the Lord, our Father and our God. We say thank you, Jesus. We thank you. We trust you. You did it before. Holy Ghost, I have a spiritual suspicion you're going to do it again. And Master, I sense in my spirit you're going to do something this week. That you're going to manifest some miracles in March that we never ever seen. Because the power of prayer do it for somebody's child somebody's marriage somebody's mind somebody's heart renew somebody's faith Jesus help them trust you to not put their trust in things but to put their trust in you my God and we know you'll do it may the Lord bless you may the Lord keep you May the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and grant you peace. And all of God's children said amen, amen, and amen. Give him praise if you trust him, if you trust him. Give him praise if you trust him. I said give him praise. Come on, come on, if you trust him. I said if you trust him. No, I said if you trust him. No, I said if you really, really, no, if you really trust him, give him the glory. Come on, give it to him. If you trust him, give it to him. Praise him like you know it's done for this week. Woo! 
I said, pray like you know it's done. 